Hey everybody, today we are going to follow on the same series. We're doing a, a Claude Sonnet 3.5 episode, but this time what we're going to do is we're going to actually make a project plan for an SEO project and we're going to convert that into a flow chart using Mermaid JS. But the cool thing is you can now do this natively in Claude in Cloud AI on the web app because in the past, if you wanted to convert something into a flow chart using Mermaid JS, you would have to use some type of tool that can interpret Mermaid JS, and then yeah, it's just extra steps that you had to take. But we're gonna do all this natively. So the first thing I'm gonna do is I'm actually gonna take a couple of YouTube videos that I found online that are relevant to um, the re relevant to just uh, SEO in general. Um, and so I'm going to copy the transcript here. So first of all, what I want to do is I want to go back to Claude and I want to instruct based on the below text, please formulate a project plan to, uh, uh, let's do this one, SEO and SEO project plan, the project plan will include top level tasks and for each task we will add sub tasks as well Sorry. so pasting that and then I'm going to paste this here and then I'm going to paste this here and then I'm gonna paste this, and the last one is here, I paste that. And so I'm gonna send that over. Okay, so I believe it's too long. I'm gonna get rid of some of these ones. I'm gonna get rid of this one. Maybe we'll get rid of this one, let's try again. Okay, let's get, let's get rid of this one, um, let's try again. Okay, well, unfortunately I'm not on the paid plan, but you can see what it's doing. So it's creating a project plan. It opens this up. You can see it opened up a document. Uh, project plan, keyword research, competitor analysis, on page optimizations, content creation, technical SEO, link building, local SEO, brand building, monitoring, and continuous optimization. And then it, it explains uh, the some of the key points for this plan is to start off with keyword and competitor research where you can go at the top. And then it emphasizes the importance of on-page elements such as title tags, meta descriptions, content creation, and optimization are given significant attention, including the use of NLP and semantic analysis techniques, et cetera, et cetera. Now what I'm going to do is can you turn this into a flowchart? Notice that I'm 86% I'm over the limit. Let me get rid of this. Um, try again. So now you can see that it's turning this thing into a flowchart. So this is Mermaid JS language uh, syntax, and it's going to convert it into a flowchart that you can actually view right away from the user interface. And it created a flowchart here. So now I don't like the way it looks here. So what I'm going to do at the top is instead of a top down approach, I'm going to do a left to right approach. Actually, can I edit this code at all? Oh, unfortunately, I can't edit this code. Um, Instead of TD, can you do left, right? And it's just going to change the um, orientation, and it's just going to do a left, right. It would be a lot better if we can actually edit it right away. Maybe maybe a next version you can do that. But as you can see, so the code is done. Let's go to preview, and you can see the preview. I really That really didn't do much. Um, we can zoom in. Uh, we can say, okay, start of the SEO project, and you can uh, so keyword research and selection, and then competitor analysis. And um, for competitor analysis, what you want to do is on-page optimization, or sorry, um, before you get to this part, because that's a continuation, uh, you want to identify the top competitors, analyze strengths and weaknesses, use chat GPT for unique angles. You want to use SEM rush for existing uh, rankings. You want to filter by search volume difficulty, focus on commercial keywords, analyze competitor domain authority. And then let's go here. Then you want to work and focus on on-page optimization. And then you want to do content creation optimization. 
optimize title tags, meta descriptions, content structure, implement schema markup, and then for content and creation optimization, you want to focus on developing a content calendar. You want to create a, a high quality content, incorporate NLP techniques. You want to optimize for feature snippets and then technical SEO, which is um, conducting an audit and improving the load time, ensuring mobile responsiveness, fix broken links and errors, link building and off page. So for link building off page, you want to develop a strategy, you want to create linkable assets, you want to conduct outreach, you want to monitor backlink profiles, and then you want to do local SEO if applicable. You want to do uh, that goes straight to brand building. For brand building, you want to focus on developing a marketing strategy. You want to optimize social media profiles. You want to engage in content marketing. You want to consider PR opportunities. And then for monitoring monitoring and reporting you wanted to continue um, set up analytics tools probably GA4 Google search console etc track keyword rankings monitor organic traffic create performance reports uh, and then what you want to do for is continuous optimization so set up a review and update strategy um, schedule stay informed about updates experiment with new techniques conduct periodic content audits evaluate results and then if goal achieved yes maintain and refine strategy and if goal is not achieved identify areas of improvements and it goes back all the way to the beginning keyword research and selection so that in a nutshell is a flow chart this would have taken you hours and hours, even though I would say this SEO strategy is needs to be refined. Um, I personally don't run SEO strategies like this. It's sort of rudimentary. I think SEO strategies need a little bit more thought and you need to understand um, the business and you need to understand the competition landscape, et cetera, et cetera. But this is an amazing starting point. The power of Claude Sonnet 3.5. So until next time, thank you very much and see you guys later.